Hi everyone, today I'm going to introduce one product I found on Amazon. And this product is kind of a solution that I've been wanting for, for a long time. And this is the vlog monitor. So I always wanted to use my real camera for vlogging or selfie because I just kind of think the front camera sucks and it doesn't have the, uh, you know, three options to zoom in and zoom out. So there was not a solution until recently I found this one on Amazon. So this one costs about 70 bucks and it does the job I need, but there are some drawbacks to this monitor I want to mention later. And this is how currently it is set up. Um, the package comes with a monitor, a, a holder, which is for the phone and as well as for the monitor itself. And it comes with a remote control and also a charging cable for charging this monitor because this monitor has a battery in it. Um, yeah, so that's basically how it looks right now after you set it up, which is quite neat. And then there are a few drawbacks I want to mention. The first drawback is when you are using the vlog monitor, it is not touch screen. So basically you cannot change the setting by using this monitor. You have to flip it over and do your change in this monitor. The second drawback is um, you cannot use this USB-C port to connect to your iPhone uh, to output your video to this monitor. It only connects your phone to this monitor through wireless LAN or wireless Wi-Fi Direct Connect. I wouldn't recommend using the wireless LAN because the connection is not stable. Uh, sometimes the monitor is not responsive. And the third drawback I would say is once you are doing screen sharing, your audio would also be pushed to this vlog camera. And because this vlog camera doesn't have a speaker, so when you play any music or video while connecting, to this vlog monitor, there's no sound coming out from this speaker and there's no way you can adjust it back to use your phone speaker to play that music or sound. So how does this work? You clip the holder to your phone and then you attach the monitor to the back of this clip and it's through magnet. So you can see I can move around without you know dropping this monitor from this clip so the magnet is quite strong. Since there's one quarter screw hole on the bottom of this holder, so basically you can attach a tripod or any kind of tripod to it. This tripod is not included. Uh, I, I purchased this one uh, from somewhere else, but it works on any kind of tripods. And, and this is the vlogging kit that you can get. There are two ways connection you can use to connect the vlog monitor to this phone. Uh, the first one is using the wireless LAN and I don't recommend that. I will explain that later. The second way is using a direct connect. So if you want to use the direct connect, basically what you can do is when this phone is off, you can switch from M to D and hold this start button. And I think the monitor will start shortly. Okay, it, it, it already turned on. And what you can do is you can go to Wi-Fi. Uh, you can connect to this. Wi-Fi hotspot that was generated by this vlog monitor. And then you can see um, it's still not connected yet, but what you can do is very simple. So do screen sharing and then hit, you know, the monitor that you just wireless connect to it. And then now if you flip it over, you can see it's working, right? And then you can start your camera right now. It is not touch screen. But what you can do when you are trying to take photos is you can hit the volume adjustment button and it will take pictures. I think the good thing is it comes with a remote for iPhone. And this remote is connected to this phone through Bluetooth. It works right now. This USB-C port is not for connecting this monitor to this phone. It only used for charging this vlog monitor. And that's it. I think if you really want to use your real camera for vlog or selfie, 
I think this is a product that you need on the market right now. There's no other choice. And yeah, it's quite convenient once you have this connection set up. Yeah, I'll put the, the link below so you can purchase it if you need it. Uh, buy this one when you need this one. Okay, bye.